Oh, they already leave without us. What are we doing? Where are they? We're going to go ride. With what? <laughs> Nerd bikes. No, with more than just us. <laughs> oh. Somehow we managed to get a group together. We got like uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bikes. I don't know how this worked out, but it worked out. We uh, got a whole bunch of people to uh, come out and ride that have been hiding for a long, long time. Still no girls. Yeah, still no girls. I know today's gonna be very interesting though. If there's not at least one meltdown today, I'll be very surprised. It'll be for me. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, well, we'll see y'all when we get there. Ciao. All right, well, I'm a complete moron. I found out something new. I thought if I muted my microphone using the camera, it would only mute the mic and would still record with the camera audio. But it doesn't. It actually just mutes the whole thing. So there's a couple clips here in this video where there's going to be no audio. <clears throat> we got here about 10.30 in the morning and took off down the trail for like a little warm-up loop. And of course, we roll past Splatterhorn. So I got to check it out to see how it looks after Hurricane Helene rolled through. Definitely doesn't expect the group to want to mess around with this right off in the beginning. But to my surprise, Ricky hooks the left down here at the bottom and sends us straight to Splatterhorn at 10.30 in the morning. Now rolling up to it, I expected it to be a nasty, sloppy, mucky mess down here at the bottom, but so much water rolled through that it actually cleared off any of the soft stuff it was a nice hard packed bottom down here. And to my complete surprise, the hill wasn't soft at all either. It's actually extremely rough right now. It's way rockier than it's ever been and there's nothing loose on it. It was super sticky. So I turned around and gave it a second shot. And this one kind of upset me a little bit because I should have made it. I don't know if my fork smacked the bank or what happened right there, but something just stopped all my forward momentum. So I had to wrestle the bike to the top of the hill and while I was doing that, to my surprise, Mr. Harden Duro, aka Jimmy, decided to hit the hill without even telling anybody. Hey, Mr. Harden Dura just gave it a shot. That's crazy. Hey, good job! That's a solid try. I'm proud of you, you know that. I hope you do. All right, rule three, let's do it one more time. I hope he waits for me to get down there and get video. I really want to get video if he tries it again. Hey, don't do that. Yeah, because that's a drop off. Yeah, and why are you going to do it without me being here? <laughs> Can't even get it on video. Hey, there you go. Yeah. Hey, that's, that's wrong, but that's your best bet. What do you do? Hook and ho sling it? Dude, it no, that's somebody went up in the air and came straight to the back. Snapped this tree off and landed down here. Yeah, <laughs> what? It was a good crash and you didn't let me get it on video? It looped if that out. that tree didn't fucking... stop it there, it would have came down that whole bank over there. It would have never that stopped. That tree that's like... Oh, no. <laughs> Yo, do a kickflip. Oh. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm so proud of him right now. The trick is learning to ride down it. Just go with it. Just Ricky, you get out of the way and just let him go. Just let it pull the clutch and kick off. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> I'm proud of you. <laughs> that was great. I can't believe you tried it. Look at that, dude. Who's Kavana? All right, this right here is gonna be the last voiceover section, and watch this crash right here. This is pretty stupid. I don't know how this happened. I just hit the rut and washed out. What an idiot. 
But the crazier thing was, I somehow managed to break a spoke when I did that. Tell me how that happened. The only thing I can think is maybe a root or rock just cleaned the nipple right off the wheel. But I ended up just slapping a zip tie around it and zip tied it to an extra spoke just so I could keep riding for the day. And the group wanted me to lead, and you know me, if I'm going to lead, we're going to go do this stupid stuff. And this is a little bit of a taste of hard enduro for a couple of the new guys. Trevor here on the RM is pretty new to getting back into riding. He hasn't rode in about 10 years. Pretty much zero woods riding experience. On a one to old, old clapped out 125 two stroke. That part was pretty funny. I know in his head he's going blah, 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 tire, car, blah, blah, blah. This dude right here is on a 250L. Absolutely killed it all day. God damn, Daryl. Oh my God. Mr. Motocross over here going to try to do a backflip up this little hill. I was hoping to maybe get everybody to go up this hill, but after hitting it and seeing how covered in roots it was, and uh, I couldn't even get to the top without falling over like an idiot. Ricky managed to make it to the top, no problems. Mr. Jimmy over here gave it a good try. I was proud of him, man. He gave it a good, everything he looked at, he gave it a shot. So we decided just to roll off this hill and I figured we would go down a little bit more mellow of an enduro line and we would just follow the creek bed down. But me continuing to be the idiot that I am and the fact that Hurricane Helene came through two weeks earlier, I didn't put two and two together and didn't think about the riverbed being completely different than it had been before. And this spot right here was a little bit deeper than it looked. And we may or may not have lost one of the bikes right here for a short period of time. <laughs> Goodbye, RM. Goodbye. Will it start though? No, we'll be sitting here taking turns kicking now. <laughs> I'm going to go over into the front stuff. You want a what? <laughs> Not in the bed. She misses her girlfriend. <laughs> There's a lot more to it than Say, that. I miss you. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> There's a lot more to it than that. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. <laughs> Alright, Megan, lead us around. Alright, well, I guess I'm leading and I ditched my microphone, so hopefully the wind will isn't too bad. I gotta figure out a better way to mount it on my helmet. It gets on my nerves. I feel it pressing against my face and it's just too much to worry about. 
run, 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 just watch, his, watch these two sticks down here and you're good. Just watch these two sticks. Dude, I, I clotheslined that on purpose thinking it was just going to break and it said, bleh, bleh, get pulled in my throat. Lewis come rolling right by and just kept on riding. He probably was, he probably was shaking his head. What? This thing is massive. Good job. That was professional. Broken RM. Don't buy a Suzuki. I think his, uh, his clutch is like staying engaged. Clapper. Clapper. Clap. I wanted to go over those rocks. <laughs> hey, Megan! Megan! Y'all can go around and we'll meet you at the bottom of the big hill. Okay. On the 250 L, dude, let's go! Woo! Bad spot. <laughs> Should've stayed in the creek. I'm gonna keep running the creek all the way up to the ends. They gotta watch who they tell the lead. They tell me to lead. We're gonna do the hard stuff. Follow me.
You get around it. <laughs> Dude, Warren's on crappy DOT tires. Well, I made it. Yeah. What are they doing? Yeah, what are they doing? <laughs> Y'all can stay to the left when we go up here. I'm gonna drop back in the creek and run the creek all the way up to it ends. I can't believe you're making traction with that tire. That's amazing. It really is. That's so crazy. I love no dab challenging in this. I'm going to put my foot down. Yeah, I'm happy right here. Oh, this is fun. What do You all right? Woo. You good? <laughs> you want first? What did you hurt? That. You got stitched. Hit me right in the face. Oh, you're good in your face. You ain't bleeding or nothing. You just yeah, you got a little cut. Little, little nick. What's that? A snake bite. It's amazing our bikes are only like 20 pounds difference in weight, but yours is so much lighter. <laughs> Stay to this side. Okay, don't go in this rut. Everybody's hit that rut. Oh my god! I tried to everybody avoid that. Everybody hit it. Hey, go around. Go that way. Where were you at? I was looking. I was a little worried. I thought maybe you wrecked somewhere, laying in the woods. No one's gonna feel everywhere. It took you forever. Alright, good. These are all good ones. Huh. There's a thousand different ways. Yeah, I remember last time. No, we didn't hit this before. Yeah, we did. I went right up through here. Maybe with a different group.
to the easy stuff. <laughs> uh, he said, where are we going? All right, I'm gonna keep me ending up through here. It's been a while since I've actually ran this whole ravine. This is what I'm gonna try to do. This is the tough part right here. Hardenduro. <laughs> I love this stuff. This is why nobody wants to ride with me, man. I got out here and do this stuff numerous ways. Man, it's not too hard, dude. I want to blah, 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 four wheeler trails. Oh man, I wanted to do that clean. <clears throat> oh! Now I gotta get over this freaking log. Zero control there. Did you see that big rock face off the left side? That's that notch where I've rode up and then you hook off the left and go up and over that big rock face. Where'd she go, take a poop? <laughs> oh, take a poop, all right. Who was that? Nobody likes my trail suggestions. It's too slow, too many stops. Now we're gonna go run the, uh, I guess the race loop from a couple weekends ago. Got Tinkerbell back here. Yeah! 
was awesome. <laughs> I wish I was recording. That was hilarious. That was such a good crash. I saw that. <laughs> because I'm stuck at the point where now I don't want to be riding the turn track or the other little motocross track or the little easy trails because I get bored at least by myself but then I'm not good enough to keep up with these guys so it, it's, it's a rough, rough place to be I'm trying my best but I'm just not that fan and I feel bad because they don't want to sit here and hang around and wait on me. You know? Well, I'm driving Miss Daisy back to you. And then, they're going so fast that I don't catch which way they go sometimes. So then I end up on the wrong track. Then it's fine because then we get met back together. But, I don't know. I miss this adventure daily. That's my girl. With now, just crashing on myself. See, they're already gone. And I mean, I'm still making the trails, which is great because I can do it. I know, but I just have to do it at my own speed and my own pace. That sucks. But then, I don't know. I'm getting frustrated. And I'm dirt. I'm sure they're not frustrated, but I know. They want to go faster and do more fun things without me weighing them down by the bar. So, I don't know. This sucks. I'm stuck in the point here. I don't know. I'm going to go for level. I'm not like, I'm like a medium rare level mistake degree because I'm not like rare. I don't know what I'm trying to say. This homeboy out here is like, I ain't read more of a point in the woods and yet he's killing it on this bike. It's probably like 500 pounds. I don't think I can do that. I'm sure Jacob explained, but we just had that big um, hurricane come through. It didn't hit us that bad, but it did clear some things up here. I don't know if I can do that. Would it be smart for me to go ahead and turn around now? Oh, wait. What are you doing? Ha ha ha! You guys got it.
Mm -hmm. Where'd you get so muddy? Fucking wiggy. I wanted to see how they try this because this is a good hill climb to play on. This is one of the first ones we did here. Yeah, it's a it's a moderate hill climb. It's, it's hard. This is rooty. But it's it's easy to turn around on. Yeah. Up a I mean, I've done it, but this is the one I broke my arm on, yeah, so I'm not doing it. Twice. I have PTSD. <laughs> It's not bad. It's easy to turn around on. It's just don't don't stall out and roll backwards. Because <laughs> we can run up this or we can run the trip. Megan, you might have to go that way to meet up with us. Because it's either go up the really rocky shit or you can go hit your hill. Yeah, my hill's right over there. I don't know what it looks like though. We go right. We're gonna run the red. Oh. Go for it. Okay. Trail. Hey, leave your bike against the tree. Oh, yeah. This is what you're doing. Pull forward up against the tree. That's smart. Is it good? Y'all should have went to my hill. It's a little bit harder. Yellow Skittle. to slow down. Use your clutch to control your speed. I do not miss
Try it. Hard. No? What? Oh, I don't know if I can make it up that hill. Can I go blue? Roll backwards. Oh, yeah. Hey. I didn't make it. You're good. You got it. I tried it though. That was pretty good, right? Yeah. I start from right there? Yeah. You guys have to sit there and wait on me to catch up. But yeah, I miss my girlfriend. <laughs> um, but it was a fun day. I can't believe we had this big of a group. That might have split off every once in a while. Did you have fun? Yeah. I'm glad uh, the spider horn got cleaned up by Hurricane Helena. And then get destroyed. And out of all Banner the group. Horn got destroyed. And out of the, all the group, you got one person to try. Yeah, I was going to submit a challenge. <laughs> and this better. person I would probably least expect, kind of. I did not think Jamie was going to try. I wish you would have grabbed me because I love sitting there watching. But Sorry. it's okay. We ended up having fun. Now we're going to car rolls to get some grub. Turkey club. Let's go. Probably chicken tendies. We'll see. All right. Bye. Peace out. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, my girlfriend. Eating mozzarella sticks. <laughs> <laughs>